Welcome to Pip from CCL Forensics. I'm Alex Caithness, the developer of this tool, and over the next few minutes I'll give an overview of what Pip is and the benefits it can bring to digital investigators. A future video will look at Pip in more depth, but for now we'll concentrate on a high-level overview of the tool. So, the first and most obvious question, what is Pip? Pip is a tool which saves you time when it comes to parsing and presenting data in XML files. It also has native support for property list or plist files found on Apple devices. XML is an extremely common and widely used data format, so these files can contain, for example, web history, internet searches, recent sat-lav locations, social networking history, and many other types of potential evidence. Pip parses data from these files using the XPath query language and outputs it into an easy-to-interpret form. So, let's see this in action. Here is some sample XML data. Although text-based, it isn't massively user-friendly in its raw format. It can take a lot of manual manipulation to locate evidence relevant to your particular investigation. This takes time and ultimately costs money. Let's take a look at how PIP helps you deal with this file. So here's the same file loaded into PIP. PIP is designed to be as flexible as possible so that an advanced practitioner can write XPath queries to deal with any XML data they should come across. But PIP also comes preloaded with a library of pre-written XPaths and that's what we're going to use here. We can load the library from the XPath menu here, find the XPath that we want to use, and PIP loads it automatically. All it remains to do then is to click Run Query, and the data is automatically parsed out. From there, the data can be exported into Excel or any other spreadsheet program. PIP can also batch process multiple files all at once. For example, here I'm processing a number of files extracted from the Facebook application on an iPhone. PIP is available for free trial by visiting www.ccl-forensics.com slash PIP. Additionally, training is available on how to get the most out of PIP please contact pip at ccl-forensics.com for more information. Finally, if you have any queries about the tool, or any suggestions for additions to the library of XPath queries, please do contact us. Thanks for taking the time to watch this brief presentation, and remember, more information is available at www.ccl-forensics.com.